So the theme of the animations today is wind. We had a really good turnout for this May monthly challenge. I feel like wind is a really amazing element for making something dramatic, for making something impactful in animation. Let's go and have a look at some of these. And at the end, I'm gonna round them up. I'm gonna show you the ones that really caught my eye. So let's get into it. I thought this entry by Daniel Ope was really interesting. We've 
got the mixture of 3D and 2D elements in this so that when this character walks through the grass and we follow him, we get the parallax effect of the grass and the rocks and things. The cape is moving very vigorously and there's it's these experimental particle effects in the air that are lit up. So uh, in composition wise, it's a very strong composition. It really leads you and draws you into this and I think it's a very well-considered entry. So well done, Daniel Ope. We saw Dino Sketches in this one really pay homage to, homage, homage? I don't know how to say that word, but pays that, pays his respects to uh, Mob Psycho, one of his major influences and uh, it's wild. This animation is really wild and crazy. We've got this vortex of wind that's just circling around mobs. So this was a really cool entry. I'm sure a lot of people can enjoy and appreciate this one. Well done, Dino Sketches. Aki Raikon, I really like this one. I think the color palette is very nice. I love the aesthetic qualities in this one. Uh, the anime kind of vibes and with the uh, cherry blossom, the, the, the petals of this blossom, the way they're coming up, sweeping up, creates this kind of uplifting feel to this one. And that's kind of contrasted by her forlorn expression in her eyes. So uh, this one's really nice. Uh, there's a lot to like about this one. This one's by Froggy Lou. And there's something I really like about this one. Um, it's a very simple idea, just a static camera uh, position and just the outlines of things. And you can see the that the wind is moving through the trees. It's very gusty kind of day. We get that a lot here in Britain. And then there's a, like this bird that's trying to take off and just kind of hesitates a little bit before taking off into the air during this gusty day. I don't know, I just like it. I think there's something about this that I really like. In the same vein, I really enjoy this one by Logthis. Just the editing of this one and the pace of this leaf falling to the ground is just captured really in an expert way. I really appreciate this one. Grammy Kamladze. This entry, super high quality. I love the painted, the textural painted backgrounds of this. And I really like the casual body language and the, the body movement of this superhero character. It really adds to the effortless feeling of something so big, just jumping off a cliff and landing like it's no big deal. Thank you for submitting that. That was very, very nice. Take a look at this one. This is by Den, and I just love the cinematic nature of this one. The dark, moody uh, kind of vibes we get by this, and the wind, and all the effects with the wind, the leaves and the, the grass that's blown and the cloak, it all just adds to that cinematic atmosphere. So I think this is a really strong entry. Take a look at this. Coming never. <laughs> Even if this is just a concept trailer, it was still a really, really cool cinematic entry. So thank you very much, Dan. A big thank you to everyone who entered for the May monthly challenge for Wind. It was really cool to look through all of your entries and to enjoy them all. And if you're interested in joining this community and joining the monthly challenges, the link to Discord, the Discord group is down below. I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.